In this video, I'm going to show you the GDPR functionality in SuccessFactors. The countdown to GDPR is fast approaching. How ready are you? Have you appointed a DPO? Have you identified your sensitive data? If you already have SuccessFactors, have you enabled the recent functionality? And have you granted access to the persons responsible? SuccessFactors is a comprehensive HCM suite and the GDPR functionality is suite wide. It incorporates change audit, read audit, data blocking, data masking, purging, retention, consent and data subject access requests. The data privacy consent statement can be customised for your business. The statement will appear when an individual logs on and they can either accept or decline. Individuals with the correct access will be able to amend the data privacy statements. They will be able to select different translations for different locations and when ready, click to re-enable the statements so that they appear when individuals log on. Data purging can now be performed within the system and you can navigate there using the home page action search. You then have the option to purge users, for example those who haven't started, or click to create a new purge request, where you can then specify the type of data you would like to purge. You can specify the template, and whether or not you want to purge a single user or a multiple set of users. You can then click to launch immediately or schedule. You can now set up data retention rules within the system. Once you have searched for your specific set of data, you then have the option to set the retention rules. You can set these differently for different locations and also choose whether to have months or years. Data subject access requests can now be performed in under one minute. You click to search for the person and then click to generate the report. All requests will then be generated within the reports tab. You have the option to export as a CSV or as a PDF. Audit reports are now easy to run within the system. You have the option to run change or read requests. You can click to specify the person you want to run the report on. and also click to specify which data. You can then set a time frame and then click Submit. All reports are then generated within the Reports tab. You then have the option to export. Thank you for listening. And if you have any further questions, please get in touch.